Hare Krishna. Welcome to Bhagavad Gita. Hi. It's class. We'll be having this course offered by Shri Shri Radha Govinda Temple is called Mangalore. These are our details. Let us offer our humble obeisances and respect to the details. Hare Krishna. We'll start the class by the prayers. Yes, please. ಶಕಲಾಂಜಯಾಕ್ಷುರ್ಷ್ಣಾಯೇ <laughs> ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ದೇವಿ ಗೌರವ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ದೇವಿ ಗೌರವಾನಿ ಗೌರವಾನಿ ಪ್ರಚಾರ ಮೇ ವಿಶೇಷ ಶೂನ್ಯವಾದ ಪಾಶ್ಚಾತ್ಯ ದೇಶ ತಾಗಣೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಮಾತಾಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಜಯ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೇದ ಗದಾಧರ ಶ್ರೀ ವಶಾದೇ ಗುರು ಗೌರ ಭಕ್ತ ಬೃಂದ ಏ ಸರಿ ಬೋಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಚಾಂಟ್ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಮಹಾಮಂತ್ರ ಟುಗೆದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ರಾಮ ರಾಮ ಹರೆ 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 ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೆ ಹೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೆ 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 ರಾಮ ಹೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಹರೆ Hare Krishna yes we are reading and discussing the bhagavad gita as it is book offered by abhay charan who was the kid name then it became abhay charan aravinda srila bhakti vedanta swami prabhupada yes now in yesterday's class we saw a shloka yes can you recite the shloka druvi ಶ್ಲೋಕೃಷ್ಣ Yes ma'am did you practice yes can you recite for us okay are you yes please yogi naam api sarvedam mat kate dharam antara atma ಸಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಟ್ಯೂನ್ ಯೋಗಿ ನಾಮ ಬಿಸರ್ವೇಶಂಕ್ ಯು now let's check what did krishna say he said the transcendental loving service for krishna is the highest of all that's krishna's opinion so we should be careful if at all someone says you have to start from the first step karma yoga gnana yoga then ashtanga yoga tell them krishna has given us a lift you can directly go to bhakti yoga anyone can start with 
bhakti yoga we should choose wisely and what about chanting how should we do the chanting the certain tricks special mantra is a panchatattva mantra when we are starting hare krishna maha mantra will be always started by panchatattva mantra jai shri krishna chaitanya prabhu nityananda shri advaita gadadara shri vasadi gauravanta yes later we should be sure am i chanting audibly i should be able to hear that is one important point we should be able to chant audibly and distinctly we should not fuse the word together we should not join hari krishna hari krishna krishna hari ram hari ram 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 we should pronounce properly distinctly with devotion full respect and concentration we should chant hari krishna maha mantra whether i can sit and chant or walk and chant yes it is allowed you can face towards any direction and start chanting when can i chant can i chant at any time definitely any time is always chosen for chanting what does scriptures refer they prefer or recommend to chant early morning brahma murta before the sunrise is very very good to chant can i chant before taking bath yes before or after taking bath it is always recommended and how do i chant and keep account simultaneously use a tulsi bead which will be having 108 beads in the mala and what should i be careful of i should not commit any sins i should not chant only some people will like only krishna they don't like rama then they will be like hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 krishna hare krishna 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 hare hare or some people will not like rama or some people will not like krishna then they will be chanting only hare rama hare rama 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 hare 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 rama hare rama 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 hare hare no we should chant hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 rama hare rama 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 hare hare and in this is krishna bead which mantra do we chant on krishna bead you remember jai shri krishna yes. jai shri krishna jai shri krishna chaitanya should be only chanted jai shri krishna chaitanya hari bol so mahaprabhu's mantra should be chanted on this later this is for our hare krishna maha mantra this should not be used for chanting hare krishna maha mantra then what happens we should be careful sometimes people will be saying you are going to school do one thing chant in one hand read in the other hand or watch the tv or even you can read the newspaper say them no chanting is taking 10 minutes i'll chant 10 minutes and then sit for reading that is the best thing to do otherwise it will be a wrong thing which you are not supposed to do we should be careful okay understanding so let us proceed our understandings and learnings in bhagavad gita as it is for chapter 7 titled as knowledge of absolute gnana vigyana so now from chapter 7 to 12 it is gnana yoga section is called as gnana yoga full of knowledge which leads to bhakti hare krishna i'm so sorry from chapter 7 to 12 the complete chapters deals with the lessons related to bhakti yoga and then from chapter 13 to 18 it is covering our gnana yoga now let us see what is the first shloka shri bhagavan uvacha maya sakta manha partha yogam yunjanma dashraya asamshayam samagram mam yata gnyasa sitachrunu now here o sanna fruta arjuna how by practicing yoga in full consciousness of me with mind attached to me you can know me in full free from doubt first thing we should notice is the first shloka of the chapter 7 is getting started by krishna himself arjuna is not asking any question arjuna is still listening and krishna is saying now pay your mind complete attention towards me because all this while arjuna was confused how to control the mind now krishna has given tricks how to control the mind practice devotional service it is easy to control the mind chant hare krishna maha mantra easy to control the mind and what are you supposed to do touch to know now hear carefully and all your doubts if at all something is remaining also will be clarified and what does he say manushyanam sahasreshu kaschidyatati siddhaye yatatam api siddhanam kaschin mam veti tatvatah 
Hare Krishna. Would you like to translate, Dhruvi? Yes, Mataji. Yeah, Hare Krishna. Out of many thousands among men, one way and and for perfection and of those who have achieved perfection hardly one knows me in truth. Hare Krishna Mataji. Hare Krishna. So Krishna has told some important steps here. Sometimes we'll be like thinking Krishna came here as a lot. Few people didn't accept him as God. Mahaprabhu came and gave the love of Godhead. Start chanting. Prabhupada came and he's saying that you can chant. But why people are not listening? The fact is, out of thousands of men, only one will be able to endeavor because of their past karmas. So that one person will be knowing the truth about Krishna. How to understand this? In case there is any race, running race or a marathon or any competition, many people will come. Few people will just come to see the race. And few will participate. When they are participating, their energy will not be supporting because they eat something which is not supporting their health. Physical fitness is also not there. And at the end, what happens? Very few will reach the finishing end. Now, many people would have practiced different types of yogas. People who are reaching the bhakti yoga Understanding Krishna are very few. Out of thousands of men, hundreds of thousands of men, Krishna is saying that is there is one person who may reach. The chance is very less. Okay, If at all you are getting a chance, don't lose a chance. Otherwise, it will take another lifetime to understand. Some people will fall down because of what? They have different bad habits. What are the bad habits? Either meat eating, gambling or intoxication or illicit sex. All these are bad activities. They'll be having so much of bad feelings in, inside. They'll be envying people. If at all they see someone good than them, they'll be like, why is he so good? Why is that other person so beautiful? Why that particular person is always praised? Why is he coming? First rank. Why not me? And lust, greed, anger, so many things will pull them down. They will be trying, in case they try towards Krishna, all these bad activities are there inside them. It will make them fall. We should give up all this bad. We should not be angry on someone who is doing something else. We should do our work, mind our work, continue in devotional service. Then we can progress towards Krishna and happily we can be with Krishna later. Yes, Dhruvi? Yes, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Krishna is the supreme personality of Godhead, the cause of all the, all causes, the prevail Lord Govinda. Govinda. Hare Krishna Mataji. Hare Krishna. Well, that is a shloka. Yeah, it is a shloka. Ishwara Parama Krishna Satchidananda Vigraha Anadira Dir Govinda Sarva Karana Karana. Mother, I can recite one sir. Yes, please. Yes, you can decide, Pa. Ishwara. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Why my voice is audible? No, it's audible. Okay, Mataji. Ishwara Parama Krishna Satidananda Vikraha Anadi Radir Govinda Sarvakarana Karanam Hare Krishna Mataji. Hare Krishna Rival. Thank you. So, what does this say in Brahma Samhita? It's also been very beautifully described. Ishwara Parama Krishna is a supreme controller. He is Krishna. He is always Satchidananda. Eternal, full of knowledge and Hananda bliss. Vigraha is in the form. Anadi Radir Govinda. He is like primeval person. Anytime he was there. There was no millisecond where Krishna was not there. And he is cause of everything. Whatever is happening in the world he is a prime cause. He is giving all the supplies for any action which is being performed. 
భూమిరాపునులో వాయు కమ్మను బుద్ధిరేవ అహంకార ఇది ఎమ్మే భిన్న ప్రకృతి హరే కృష్ణ హరే కృష్ణ మాతాజీ హరే కృష్ణ మాతాజీ హరే కృష్ణ ప్లీజ్ ట్రాన్స్లేట్ వాటర్ fire air and what else is left out ether okay all these five elements mataji what is ether ether is a like uh, when we say hair i will not be able to see the air but i will be able to feel the air right likewise there is some space for which there is certain quantity of paramatma contents there like paramatma is present but we will not able to see in a space modern science has not still proved its existence that's why it is difficult to understand what is ether okay in days okay, to come when we understand shastras better we will be able to explore the ether con- concept it actually comes in the uh, brahma jyoti emergence and the black hole ka- kind of concepts nnd prabhu says that hari krishna hari krishna mata sorry i disturbed you no no that's absolutely fine questions related to the topic are always welcome hari krishna thanks for the question many a times even i will be thinking how to explain ether because uh, uh, when our senior devotees say it is difficult to explain how will i be able to explain <laughs> this yes and next five elements are done what else mind intelligence and false ego totally it is becoming eight mind is something which we are trying to control so that we can lead our all the steps towards krishna intelligence means after understanding something i'll be able to distinguish whether this is good or bad i can decide whether this is appropriate or inappropriate so that is the intelligence and false ego where people say i am the one doing everything like hiranyaksha hiranyakashipu ravana and so many others they will feel and we should not only remember them there's false ego inside us also sometimes if someone says you can learn this we will be like i already know right that is false ego we should be careful all this energies these are all the material energies which is again coming from krishna it is separated material energies of krishna all of this material energies whether it is material world like we have earth or the spiritual world the goloka vrindavana everything is from krishna krishna is the origin for everything and krishna is the reason for everything going to end so origin and dissolution is also been caused because of krishna's will it is krishna's will origin it will happen krishna's will the dissolution end of that world will happen and now his please translate hari krishna hari krishna mata ji o conqueror of wealth arjuna there is no other superior to me everything rests rests upon me as pure pearls are sung or not thread hare krishna so hare now, krishna mati thank you so mari what is strung strung means they are holding together on a thread okay now we know if at all there is a chain a pearl thread okay inside that the thread is there but we cannot see the thread because pearls are covering likewise krishna is there everywhere and is holding everything in its own place where it is distinct distinct to be like if the sun is supposed to be in its position who is holding the sun it is krishna who is holding if at all there is a cloud moving in one particular direction it is krishna who is holding but we will not be able to see krishna 
just like even though in the necklace or any other pearls rings this thread which is inside we cannot see krishna is there everywhere that is the ultimate truth he will be the controller of everything and he controls everything and we should understand everything is resting upon krishna is resting upon krishna is the support for everything without krishna nothing will stand nothing will be present also yes please translate asai shumati ji o son of kunti arjuna i am the taste of water the light of the sun and the moon the syllable om in the vedic mantras vedic mantras i am the sound in ether and ability in mind hare krishna mata ji hare krishna thank you so now krishna is giving some evidences how he is present everywhere like when we drink water there certain taste how can i feel the taste when you are like very tired you have walked for 10 kilometers you are very tired it is so sunny and now if someone comes and gives you a hot milk will you be happy to drink the milk when you are tired or no matter ji no but if someone ji. offers the water we will be like happy to take the water because water has got a taste it has got the power to quench our thirst it will give us relaxation because krishna is there so from now on whenever we take the glass of water to drink or a bottle of water we can think yes krishna is the taste of water and when we are drinking we can honor krishna krishna thanks for the taste of the water you have given us a chance to remember you even while drinking this is how a devotee will always concentrate remember krishna every step every second we should remember krishna how if i drink water krishna is a taste of water and when i am not drinking light is there whether it is day sunlight is there or it is night moonlight is there that light is also from krishna whenever we see the sunlight or the moonlight krishna is always there so we can always thank krishna for giving his presence and association throughout our life the syllable om in vedic mantras every vedic mantra if it ever we start om bhur bhuvasvaha om agnyanat mirandasya or take even for the demigods all the devatas all their mantras also will start from om because om itself means it is representing krishna and krishna says is a sound in the ether there is a space which is creating the vibrations those vibrations which are very spiritual which can create things that particular ether has a sound right that sound is also coming from krishna that is krishna himself and whoever has got the work doing ability a man or a woman all those people will be having the ability which is generating from krishna hare krishna so now these are the elements and krishna says how exactly is there like five elements we know earth water air fire ether earth we all understand we see the grass is growing on earth there is temple getting constructed on the land that is earth and it will hold water what is water almost all of us have seen water is in liquid state or solid state or in the gaseous state and water will be having aquatic animals inside it fishes will be there and sometimes we can wash hands we can get ourselves clean with water air which we are every time breathing through which we are getting the energy right oxygen is there likewise so many other gases fire and here fire can be seen and can be touched air cannot be seen but in case air is getting contaminated by smoke or some other color then we can see air otherwise we can just feel water taste of water can be felt but some people will say water has got no taste because they don't understand what exactly is the taste of water and earth component we can see touch all the five senses can be used to experience the presence of earth 
when it comes to ether it is slightly difficult that's why we prefer for vibrations and sound techniques there okay now yes can you please translate hare krishna hare krishna mata ji one minute i came just now from the uh, office one minute mata ji okay i'll say hare I am the original uh, fragrance. I am a, I am a, I am the original fragrance of the earth, and I am the heat in fire. I am the life of that living lives, and I am the presence of all associate. Hare Krishna, Mata Ji. Hare Krishna, thank you so much. So now, Mata Ji, I know the shloka. Hare Krishna, Mata Ji. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. What is penances? Penances means the austerity. We can think tapas. We can take for understanding tapas. So now, first, what is Krishna saying? Krishna is saying is the smell, fragrance <laughs> of earth. Fragrance or smell of the earth means whenever there is a rain pouring down onto the earth, that aroma will be there. Yes, Mataji. Smell of the soil that is coming from Krishna. Okay. Second, I am the heat of the Mataji. fire. Mataji, Mataji. what is fragrance? Smell, aroma. Smell. Suvasani, suganda. Mataji, uh, I learned this shloka. I'll say at last, Mataji. Okay, pa. Hare Krishna. Okay, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Krishna. So now he is again specifying in the fire. whatever heat is coming it is also krishna i am the heat of the fire in case someone is going towards the fire and they see all of a sudden there's only one step ahead they will run back right but if they don't know then they will go and touch like small kids when they don't know they will try to touch the fire once they learn they will not touch it again so heat is also coming from krishna there are different kinds of heat inside our body also we have got heat because of that i am alive so krishna is making us alive and krishna says is a life is giving life to all the lives he is the one who is giving the life for everyone and among all the aesthetics there are so many rituals there are so many ways to perform please krishna among that tapas the penance is krishna's favorite krishna says i am the tapas now o son of pruta know that i am the original seed of all existence cause of all causes right krishna confirms this he is the seed giving father in case there is no seed how will a plant grow how will a tree from no there is no chance who is giving the seed krishna is giving the seed krishna is the original source for everything how does a small seed know to grow like a big tree and different number of seeds they know how they have to grow which flower they have to give and what season they have to culture how is this possible they may say this is genetics they may say this is scientific but again they lacking to understand krishna is there some people have already accepted the acharyas have accepted and given us the right information and whoever is intelligent their intelligence also is coming from krishna and even if they say they are powerful power powers is also coming from krishna and this is a tabular column representing all and in tomorrow's class this will be empty okay among water what is krishna then we have to say taste of water is krishna and in moon and sun what is krishna light in vedic mantras om in eta we should remember sound the vibrations earth fragrance fire heat okay and in life in all living being life is krishna दैवीयुणमयी मया दुरात्य मेवाये प्रपद्य मैयामेत तरंदे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण माताजी जस्ट दिवान एनर्जी ऑफ माइंड कंसिस्टिंग 
of the three modes of material nature is difficult to overcome but those who have surrendered un unto me can easily cross beyond it hare krishna mata ji hare krishna so now krishna clearly says you imagine that one person is swimming from india and he wants to go to america while swimming can he go no no mata ji no it is very very challenging in case he is getting a break and he is getting food supply everything on the road maybe we will take a break rest for 5 months then travel again but in case i have to imagine to go it will take so many years right now what is krishna speaking about krishna is speaking about the bhava sagara means birth and death cycle of birth and death it is very difficult for a common man to cross that but for those who have surrendered to krishna who has taken their conscience towards krishna they are devotees for them it is very easy why krishna himself is coming on his own vehicle garuda and taking them out of this sufferings and he will deliver them they will be happy later on this is possible only when we surrender to krishna only those who have accepted krishna as supreme personality of godhead they chant hari krishna mantra every day without fail and they'll remember krishna every time whatever they do they accept this is because of krishna's mercy then it is possible otherwise they will be having lots of difficulties to overcome which they will not be able to do alone when krishna is there everything is becoming easy yes purna please translate oh oh best among these bharatas bharata bharatas ajna for kinds of pure men men re rendered devotional service unto me unto me the distressed unto me the distress the desire of wealth the inquisitive the inquisitive and the who is searching no of knowledge of the all all absolute, absolute. hare krishna absolute. thank you hare krishna mata ji hare krishna mata ji hare krishna mata what is inquisitive like you <laughs> like we want to learn more right and we are like inquisitive to know what exactly are we speaking and more than that you have above that dravi so let's understand world by world so krishna says there yes, are people ma'am. who will surrender whoever is surrendering to krishna are called pious men they are religious pious men and whoever does not surrender to krishna they are miscreants they are bad people they will not be knowing what is the truth and they will be busy doing their own rules and regulations some will say i am god some people will say i will take to god some will say i am the businessman i can do whatever i want i will get money some will be like donkey is just working but person who knows krishna is god there are four kind of people like one renders devotional service in distress whenever they have pain they don't have leg or they don't have any proper support they'll go to krishna to take the support they are in distress means stress level is so much more they'll go and ask krishna to get them revealed from the stress and they want to become happy next the desirer of wealth means he is desiring something for wealth he want more money so is like he is having so many kids he does not know how to feed them so he is requesting krishna my kids are hungry give me money so that i can feed them he is like desiring for wealth and money next number 3 inquisitive they want to know what is happening what is happening around the world like modern science scientist and so many people they are inquisitive just to know what is happening but when you take the same inquisitiveness as you people are discussing about the truth of the absolute knowledge then you are becoming a bhakti gnani that is the searching for knowledge of the absolute 
There are four types of people, one who surrenders in pain, one who is desiring the wealth, and one who is like thinking, what is happening? Let me check. If at all there is an accident in a place, what happens? People want to just go and check. Even if they're not going to help them, they'll check, right? So they're like inquisitive. Some people will go check, help, and do the service, thinking Paramatma is there inside everyone. So that is higher compared to just going and checking. Likewise, than going to something else, going towards Krishna, searching for the truth is the purest one. And Krishna likes them most, whoever is surrendering to Krishna. And now in this picture, we have got few examples how different kinds of people have surrendered to Krishna. Here, in this case, Gajendra is surrendering to Krishna and Krishna is coming to rescue. Why do you think he's surrendering? Does Gajendra want money? Does he wants knowledge? Or does he wants to be saved from pain? Help what mother. Is, save what is, from pain. Save from pain. Yes. So now Gajendra is distressed. Next year we are seeing Draupadi. She is also like praying for Krishna. Save me. So what does it say? Is it like first? Which of the category Draupadi belongs to here? You can guess. Does she want knowledge at this time? Or does no, she want I mean. money? Is she inquiring? She want, Krishna. She wants help. She wants help. This want help. Help. Yes, whenever we want help, we should remember whom should we call out? Krishna. Krishna. Yes. Next, when we have got a situation, this is a situation where <laughs> Sukadeva Goswami was not at all coming out. He was there hundreds here inside 13 years. He's not coming out. He's inside the womb because once he comes out, he's scared that he'll forget Krishna. Okay. That is also very, very high level of thinking. And here Parikshit Maharaj and the, we have got Sukadeva Goswami. Sukadeva Goswami is saying the narrations, the pastimes, what and all Krishna has done and how the devotees were there, how association was there when Krishna is there. So that narration was happening. This is pure learnings, right? And even in Naimisharanya, there were thousands of sages who sat and were listening to the Acharya. Next, here, Dhruva Maharaj is there. Yes. What did Dhruva Maharaj want actually? Anyone knows why but, Dhruva Maharaj wanted? Yes, Mother Ji. Yes, Mother Ji. He, he wanted to... He wanted? To sit in his uh, ma, father's lap. Yeah, he wanted to sit in his father's lap and his uh, stepmother was there who pushed him away, saying that you cannot sit, you get down. My son, let him go and sit. You are the not the son. The another wife of yeah. uh, Dhruva Maharaj's father. Haribol, yes. So now he is like thinking, if I have the kingdom, then my father will appreciate me also. So he will go and search of wealth. Now what is happening? Even though Dhruva Maharaj was going in search of wealth, he went to Krishna, right? So he is Desire is also getting purified. He was a very small kid, five-year kid. He went and prayed to Krishna and Krishna was pleased. And he gave him more than whatever he was asking for. Yes. Hare Krishna, any doubts here? Father, you, you, is, Hare Krishna, you will say that last story of Dhruva Maharaj once again. Yeah, in chapter 9, we have a story of Dhruva Maharaj. It will come in slides itself. Okay, Mataji. Okay. And even Prahalad Maharaj okay. will come in 8th chapter likewise. So, there will be lots to discuss on Dhruva Maharaj, Prahalad Maharaj. Because kids, right? And they are devotees. We definitely have to discuss them. At least, Shravanam Kirtanam will happen. That. Shravanam Kirtanam. Yes. Very old. And now, in this picture, we are seeing Rama is joining the hand with Hanuman. 
to kill wali and hanuman was requesting wali is becoming a trouble he is fighting with sugriva please help then rama will help so in different types different situations different people have asked the help of krishna and krishna has always helped them if you are asking the help when you are distressed also krishna will help if you are asking to know more about krishna also he will be happy to help even if you are asking for the wealth krishna is very very eager to help krishna is a supreme controller yes please what is who is wali and sugriva in ramayana there is a past time hanuman will be there and his cousin brothers and cousin maternal parents will be there okay no paternal one father side what is sugriva sugriva and wali are cousin brothers of hanuman yeah okay mother i know that message yeah the same one hari bol yes thank you now in this picture you can see this is sudama and his clothes are torn you know there was a condition where sudama his wife and his children were suffering and they were like starving daily without food then his wife reminds sudama your friend krishna he is a king dwarakadish can you go and ask him some wealth whoever visits he is giving so much of money so much of wealth so much of food to eat when you go i think you can definitely get something so that our kids will survive then sudama will be like oh no he is my friend but how will i go and ask he is a king what will i offer is a vaishnava any time if we visit we should take something so that we can offer them sudama so was a brahmana and he was like what to do and some of them will manage to get the puffed rice and by the time he is coming to the palace his rice is also getting wet and crumpled it is not that very nice to offer so he is hiding he is not giving to krishna but what does krishna do actually when sudama enters the kingdom the soldiers the door keepers will stop at the gate itself you are not supposed to enter your dress is so dirty your all torn clothes why are you entering the kingdom he says krishna is my friend and they'll all start laughing you are looking like a bikari a beggar is krishna your friend and they will be criticizing then krishna will get to know the message sudama has come the friend of krishna has come and he'll start running towards sudama he will receive sudama with great happiness he will take him and make him sit on his own throne chair of krishna and he will wash the leg of sudama that is how the vaishnava devotees will do krishna is teaching a lesson for all of us here if a tall a vaishnava is coming clean their leg first offer them now at least we can offer them um uh, mug of water to wash their legs this is what people will do even without removing the slippers they'll start entering the houses i don't know how feel how they feel to enter we should remove the slippers wash our legs and enter this is a culture and that's how during covid everyone did because covid taught them a lesson otherwise they were like all struggling to remove the slippers and come wash their legs means no like you can't do if something bad is happening then they will learn a lesson when krishna told in good way why didn't they listen something has to be going wrong only then will they listen why is this so bad okay let us continue so always we have to offer water wash their legs and krishna being a king is washing the leg of poor person because he is a friend he has come to visit then he will offer him so much fruits to eat and sudama will be hesitant to even eat and sit on the asan yeah still krishna will serve and he will be like already krishna knows he has got perfect price so he's like you got something for me he'll open and he will be like yeah it is very nice they will have nice time they'll discuss and after some time sudama will go back to his house without asking anything he will not say krishna i have got pain my kids are not having food nothing he will go back and once he is returning he will be like confused where is my house gone the hut was supposed to be there there's some palace someone has constructed their new house for them then he sees his kids are running out of that palace notices his wife oh 
then you get to know krishna is ever merciful even if i am not asking he can give krishna is very very generous very very kind he loves his devotees he loves his friend if at all we are taking one step towards krishna he will take 10 steps and he will starts running towards us sudama just took one step going approaching krishna he didn't even ask krishna came and gave everything more than he can ask for more than he can think of that is krishna krishna is always pleasing like krishna says of the many births and deaths it is possible for one to actually know the knowledge and they'll surrender otherwise they'll be like busy taking the birth and dying they'll take the birth grow and die they take the birth grow perform some activities and die many births bahunam janmanam ante it takes many many births to understand this and oh arjuna as a supreme personality of godhead i know everything who else can know krishna is creating everything krishna is dissolving everything means ending everything he knows why does he know because everything is lying on krishna is told right everything is resting on krishna krishna is a support so he obviously know what has happened in the past what has happened one day before two days before or few years before 10000 years before also he knows what is happening in the present if at all we ask what is happening in america now we have to go check the news channel but for krishna it is easy he is everywhere and he knows everything he even knows what is happening in the sun planet what is happening in the moon uh, satellite and so on different universes also he knows and whatever is yet to come in the future also krishna knows krishna knows all the living entities whatever they are and there is nothing which krishna does not know if something is there it is because of krishna and krishna knows everything and how is this to be understood how does krishna know krishna is there inside all of us like what what form of krishna is there inside all of us shankar chakra gada padma shankar yeah. parama 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 yes. parama hari bol and is only shankar chakra gada padma and that is very very much active inside us he is giving us a permission to perform all the activity then he knows everything everywhere every person whoever is doing anything he knows that yes there are certain gunas which are controlling people three modes of material nature are there one two and three they are controlling the people and whoever is controlling them the material mode is also been controlled by krishna krishna is the ultimate perfection and everything is working according to krishna's plan that is krishna's mercy if at all we are trying to listen to bhagavad gita discuss on this render at least some menial service to prabhupads are krishna movement it is because of krishna's permission we are doing without krishna's permission it is impossible for us all to assemble here and learn about gita we should always thank krishna when we surrender to krishna this material mode of nature will leave us free when they know we are doing for krishna they will not control us they will let us free and yes krishna is the god supreme personality of godhead is person his beautiful form is shamsundar form krishna is always sachidananda hitaha now story time hunter and fox let's read one by one hunter and fox the story tarini mata ji yes hari bol mata ji hari krishna hari hari krishna mata ji is mata ji you can start hari krishna purna and druvi so one by slide one by one by one you go on okay ओके
जरूरी हरे कृष्ण ध्रुवी But he saw the king approaching him, so he put the fox behind his coat on his back as fox hunting illegal. Hare Krishna, Mata Ji. Hare Krishna, just a minute. So now, what happened? There was a hunter in a forest, and he was trying to kill, hunt the fox. In the same time, what happened? The king was coming. Now, if the king sees him killing the fox, because killing the fox was illegal, which was prohibited, he was not supposed to kill the fox. So he was scared. So what will happen next? Yes. Hari Krishna, Purna. The king greet, greeted him and began to talk. How are you today? Oh, I am good. Your Majesty. Hare Krishna. The king had long conversation with the hunter on various subjects from weather to defense. While the hunter was taking to the king, the half dead fox was slowly be beating the hunter in the back. However, the hunter kept on tolerating the pain and had to force himself to completely remain cool during the discuss discussion with the king. Hare Krishna. So now what is happening? When king came, he got to know that he was doing some mistake. So he was not able to share with the king what he was doing. And king kept on speaking about the weather. He was speaking about the defense system, how the enemies are coming and attacking. But this hunter didn't show any of the symptom. The fox was there. It was biting him slowly. He was trying to kill. But when king came, he stopped and he was hiding him behind, right? The fox was behind. It was biting, biting. And he remained as if nothing has happened. And he was speaking with the king. Now, Mataji, what is tolerant? Tolerant means is showing the patience level he is trying to withhold as if nothing has happened sometimes what happens we eat spices and it will be too spicy i want to drink water if there is no water we'll try to tolerate right as if there is nothing uh, spicy we'll be like okay let it, this is going to be okay let me think like that that is tolerating in case there is too hot sunny and we'll like okay i can tolerate for five ten minutes it is okay Likewise, trying to withhold, control the senses. Okay. Yes, please continue. And then the king left. Due to the beating of the half-dead fox, and soon as the king left, left, left the hunter collapsed. Collapse and dead. So he saw he hit something. First of all, trying to kill the fox was illegal, which was not supposed to be done. It was bad. And when king came, he should have at least surrendered, saying that, King, I was doing something mistake. Please forgive me. I will not do this again. But he hid that. And when fox bit also, he was trying to tolerate. We should not tolerate which is bad. We should tolerate only which is good for our devotional service. If at all I have to get up early, my mind sometimes will say, no, it is cold. You should not get up. We can tolerate the cold and get up. That is good. Not the biting of fox or someone else. If someone does something bad or someone is behaving with us badly, we should not tolerate that. We should get back to the elderly persons, teachers or parents and say what is happening. Even if someone is having a bad conversation or showing some bad touch we should be very careful we should go back to parents or any elderly person and take the help we should not tolerate otherwise like this particular hunter dead we will also have a bad consequences we should never have this if at all we don't have to have these bad consequences first and foremost thing we should not do something bad or if something bad is going on we should share with the elders then it will be okay so what is the moral of the story 
we should always revel our minds and never keep problems to ourselves. I'm asking them over. Yeah. Are Krishna. Otherwise, we'll have difficulty in Krishna consciousness. Who says this? Srila Prabhupada. Srila Prabhupada has told us when Prabhupada is saying we should be very, very attentive and we should follow. If at all some problem is there, we should never keep it to ourselves. Prabhupada. Very bold. Yes, we should reveal to the right person and get the solution done. Otherwise, it will be difficult for to progress in Krishna consciousness. Hare Krishna. Yes, now let us offer our humble obeisances and gratitude to our dear Prabhupada. Vancha Kalpata Rupesha Krupa Sindhu Vyevacha Patita Nam Pavanipyo Vaishnavibyo Namo Namaha. Ananta Koti Vaishnavurundha ki. Jai. Hila Prabhupada ki. Jai. Bhagavad Gita ki. Yes! Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama Rama Hare Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Krishna Hare Rama Hare Rama Hare Rama Hare Krishna Hare Krishna Hare Rama Hare Krishna. Yes, Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Hare Rama. Hare Hare Rama. Hare Rama. Rama Rama. Hare Hare. Hare Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Rama Rama. Hare Hare. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Bol. Yes, Poonna, would you like to recite? Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Yes. Yogi Nama. Would you like to recite the poem tomorrow? Let Poonna recite now and we'll take it up once again. Hare Krishna, Mataji. Hare Krishna. Seems like some network issue through the end. Poonna, you can start. Yogi Nama, Pisar, Vesham, Madgate, Nantar, Atmanam. What is that message next? Shadavan. Shadavan. Bajate yo maam. Same yukta tamu mataha. Hare Krishna Mataji. Hare Krishna Mataji. What is the... Hare Krishna Mataji. 